What's up guys? So today we got the uh, Black Widow full exhaust for the 2010 Z1000. Uh, we'll put these on. I picked these up off um, eBay. They're like 550 brand new, uh, but full race exhaust. Actually really impressed with their quality so far. We'll open them up and check them out, but Black Widow, um, yeah, just a great price for a full, full set of headers. Uh, but it comes with all the stuff you need. It comes with silicon sealant. Uh, and they even sent like in there a hat and a keychain and stickers and a bunch of other stuff too. So really impressive the quality. I mean, a lot cheaper than like the Acropobic or the Aero Systems 550 total for the whole header kit. So it should be pretty sweet, guys. It's going to make the Z1000 definitely louder. Uh, we might not be able to keep the Urban Brawlers just seeing on how loud it is, but we'll definitely do a uh, sound test with the stock versus this new one. So we'll see how it goes. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and open these up and check them out. Oh yeah, the quality seems really good and these are, this is pretty uh, thick steel, the welds look nice, quality looks real good. wrap guys and kind of just test fit together everything went together real smooth everything looks great the quality uh, the welds everything looks top-notch I mean for the price I'm extremely happy with these guys so it should be pretty easy pulling the old ones off and putting these on uh, and it, it should be awesome so let's get to it comes with all the hardware you need it also includes the gaskets uh, for the exhaust so that's pretty sweet it does fit the stock uh, exhaust if you have those or the Vance and Heinz should fit in there perfectly as well. So it should be pretty straightforward, guys. All you gotta do really is just remove the belly pan uh, and the side fairing there, and then uh, we can just undo the header bolts, drop the uh, stock exhaust off, and then we'll swap out with a new one. So let's go ahead and get that belly pan off. So here's a look at the stock system, guys. It just basically runs down and then has that can there. So we'll get a lot of weight savings by cutting out a lot of that. And then we'll just, uh, and plus it'll look a little bit, a little bit nicer. So we'll be removing that. Basically all we got here is just that one bolt holding the system in the back. Uh, and then obviously where it's connected to the exhaust right now, we'll take those clamps off and then uh, up where it connects in the headers. We just got to take those bolts off and I don't think we'll really have to remove anything We should be able to get in there. looks like there's enough space. So we'll go ahead and start taking this off All right, so all the screws are off the header pipes. I should just pull this back one out here and This whole thing should drop off So here's the stock one guys, it's pretty beefy, actually pretty heavy. Um, that new system is gonna be way, way lighter, I can already tell you that, just cause of the pure weight of this thing. Uh, just taking that off is gonna give us a big weight reduction. Now let's go ahead and start putting on the new headers. So the new system goes uh, two to one and then back out to two. Um, so they did label them in order, one, two, three, four, so how you're supposed to put them on. So we'll probably just pull them off one by one from there put them on the bike I uh, also came with some new some new uh, gaskets for in there so we'll go ahead and put new gaskets on and get this thing all set up and then do some sound checks guys got these on everything went on easily so now all we got to do is connect the uh, all the pipes there together and then put the split out in the back and then we'll be all set but everything went on very easily as expected uh, so I just got these kind of loosely on here right now until I fit the, that part on. And then once we get the whole system on, I'll go back through and tighten everything down. But went on easy. These things look great, guys. I can't wait to hear how it sounds. We'll go ahead and put some of this sealant that they gave to around on the inside of here for when we connect the pipes. All right, guys, so pretty much everything's back on. Just got to tighten a few things up, uh, but yeah, getting there. Looks fire, guys. Looks great. Everything's fitting perfectly. Just got to get those uh, Urban Brawlers back on that we can fire it up, do a sound check. 
whenever you do anything with the exhaust guys you want to make sure that you wipe it down with uh, alcohol just because the oils from your skin when the exhaust heats up if the oils are on there it'll burn in look shitty on your muff so make sure you just wipe them down with alcohol get them clean before you fire them up at all it's just for fun should we fire it up and see what it sounds like which is no pipe straight up let's do it Fuck, call me Def Jam because we're disturbing the peace. Yeah, that's definitely loud. So everything's back together. Um, it's probably gonna sound exactly the same because the Vance and Hines are just straight through. There's no, there's no anything in there to like baffle the sound anymore. So it's gonna be freaking ridiculous. So, God, I don't know if I, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to keep this, or maybe I'll get the sounds or inserts they have for these, or, uh, or I have some other exhaust downstairs. Maybe I'll put those on and just because it's it's stupid. So we'll take a listen, guys. Alright guys, so we'll just Alright guys. Alright, so we'll just do a quick sound comparison. This is just the stock headers uh, with the Vance and Hines, no silencers or anything like that. So just regular so you guys can hear what it sounds like and then we'll do another one after we get the headers all on. Yeah, so it's just pretty much straight pipes right now, and it doesn't run that great, probably because there's zero back pressure now. Might get the, might have to get the ECU flash. Uh, there's this guy called Ivan who does an ECU flash that's supposed to get everything just awesome for these things. That or a power commander, but I'll probably, I don't know, I'm kind of debating on doing the ECU flash instead. It's supposed to be really, really good, but uh, I don't know. Let's put the stuff on, go for a rip with this thing like this, guys, and just see see how loud it is. All right, guys, so just for funsies, we're going to go take it for a rip around and uh, see how it sounds actually riding it. <laughs> it's going to piss off the entire neighborhood, I'm sure. Uh, what I'll probably end up doing uh, is I got these Delkovics that came with the bike. Uh, these are just carbon fiber, but I'll probably end up putting these on because I have a feeling those are just going to be way too freaking loud. Uh, so we'll we'll go for a ride with the brawlers, just see how it is, but we'll probably end up putting these on when I get home uh, and then at least quiet down a little bit. Maybe I'll order the silencers for the brawlers just to see what it sounds like. Um, you know, it could still be loud and uh, maybe tone it down a bit just so it's like not 1000% obnoxious like it is right now but let's go uh let's just go see how it rides and uh how it sounds damn muffs Sounds so freaking nasty already. myself talking right now reminds me of OG muffs though Dan Moto's those fuckers were loud these are way louder I think oh god yeah definitely gonna need some kind of a, a tuner on here Just sound 
sound freaking nasty though. from like a hundred miles away. Wow, definitely uh, over the top. Come on, Grandpa. Move your shit. So guys, that is fucking ridiculous. All right, let's pull these off and then we'll put the others on. These ones, hopefully, it'll definitely, hopefully, we'll just at least tone it down a little bit because it's ridiculous right now. You can see from that test ride, <laughs> the brawlers without any silencers or anything are just way too freaking loud. So I put the Delcovics back on. We'll do a sound test with this so you guys can hear what it sounds like and then we'll go take it for a ride and see how that sounds in comparison. Oh yeah, so that sounds, that sounds much more, I mean, it's still mean and aggressive and it sounds good, but it's just not just like ear piercingly over the top loud. So I think I'm gonna stick with these for now. Maybe we'll order some, uh, silencers for the brawlers to see what kind of difference that makes but it's just too loud they're just too loud right now i never thought i'd say that but those are too loud so we'll go rip around on this see how it is all right guys so put the delcovics on they look pretty good definitely toned down just the idle sound a lot from just being completely obnoxious to tolerable so this sounds pretty good and i think i'll probably run these until maybe get some uh, silencers for the brawlers and try that because I really like the looks of the brawlers uh, but just swills were way too loud but this one sounds it's got a pretty nice tone to it so it's not over the top and ridiculous so let's go for a ride to this see how this sounds run up to the store real quick get some Kai had a request for whiskey and lettuce they're making she's making some burgers so let's give this a rip, see how it sounds in comparison. I already think it sounds quite a bit better, so we'll probably be sticking with these until we figure out uh, what we're gonna do. Oh yeah, it's, that's much more manageable. It sounds kind of similar to what the brawlers were before, uh, just when it was just the brawlers with the, the stock headers. So, yeah, it's not over the top, but I think it still sounds still sounds good. Got some uh, meat to it. So 
I think I will when I get some extra money. I'll probably pick up those brawler silencers and then we'll we'll throw those in, see how it sounds. Uh, and, and then if it's something more manageable, because I do really like the looks of the brawlers, but I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you guys like the looks of the Delkovich's better, or do you like the looks of the brawlers better? Damn must. Got the lettuce. Good to go. Yeah, I think we'll stick with these for a while, but thanks for watching, guys. Hope you had a good one. Hope you like it. Demo! <laughs> we'll see you in the next one.